Yes, there's another video at a four foot junction in Gross St. George Barbados. As I said before, it was referred to as a four foot junction because of its shape, like a four foot, unlike any other junction or roadway in here in Barbados. And it is the road that you will use to get to Bashiba, which is on the east coast of the island. And it's also a popular surfing spot that, that would be if you take the left turn, the first left turn at the junction, it will lead to Bashiba. Lead to the old, now defunct Andrew Sugar Factory. It leads to the paintings on the wall at Paris Hill, St. Joseph. It leads to St. Anne's Anglican Church at Paris Hill, St. Joseph. It leads back to Horace Hill. It leads back to Cattle Wash and the east coast of the island. The next left turn, the second left turn. Yeah, 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 yeah. The second left turn will take you back to Sweet Bottom, which is best referred to as Sweet View. But it was one of the first freedom villages here in Barbados. Also lead back to Mount Tabor Church, Clifton Hall, Clearberry, Wilson Hill, and Martins Bay, all in the parish of St. John. Martins Bay is another East Coast beach as well. And the right turn straight ahead leads back to the land at Gun Hill, Gun Hill Signal Station, Clearberry, Tate Hill. You can lead back to the parish of St. John also, which is which would be St. John Parish Church. Bath Beach. Bath Beach is also another popular beach on the East Coast in the parish of St. John. It leads back to St. George Parish Church. It leads back to St. George Parish Church. It leads back to the parish of St. Philip and Christ Church, which is in the south and east of the island. So yes, guys. The four foot junction at Grove, St. George. This is the Market Hill Groves development behind here. And this road here leads back to Market Hill, St. Augustine's Anglican Church. Yeah, St. Augustine's Anglican Church. It leads back to Applewitz Roach Village. The Country View Bar. It leads back to Locust Hall, Harvest Hill Turning, National Stadium, and back to Bridgestone. The Four Foot Junction at Groves, St. George, Barbados. Yes, this is the main artery to Bashiba. If you are coming from town, yeah, yeah. So yes, guys, this is the four foot junction at Gross in St. George. Yes, guys, all here is land behind here. And this road can also lead to Russia Village as well, which is in the parish of between the parishes of St. Thomas and St. George. It is the road that you will use to get the Andrews factory. I will do a video of Russia Village soon. Russia Village and Russia Gully. That was a very troublesome place years ago. There are persons, a lot of persons get killed and kidnapped and so on down in Russia Gully years ago. That's good. Years ago in Barbados, in stories, they would hear your parents and grandparents talk about the heart man, which was how you need to keep your and take out your heart and so on. Yeah, it was said that a lot of that used to take place in Russia Gully. It's a very lonely place. Um, that road will lead back to Sugar Hill in the parish of St. Joseph. That's right. We can enter it from Fisher Pond. 
That's good. The same road you use to get a Bashiba and the East Coast. You will use that road to get a fish upon. And to rush up the as well. Alright Linda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's guys. The foul foot junction of Groves, St. George, Barbados. And the Toton Green building ahead of me is the Groves Agricultural Station, which is the Cam breeding plant in Barbados. Yes, guys, I will do a video of the southern part of St. George. We will see the whole of St. George Valley and more country life here in Barbados. Thank you guys for watching and have a blessed evening. Yes guys, I just forgot to mention the only bus that passes here is the Bashiba, Horse Hill, Martins Bay, Clifton Hall or Flat Rock. Thank you guys for watching and have a